But first tonight, we are working new developments following our Target 12 Investigators exclusive, Where's the Chief? And new since 6 o'clock tonight, we now know who will lead the independent investigation into the conduct of the chief of the Coventry Fire District. We were there last week when Paul Labadia was suspended following our exclusive undercover report, which showed him getting behind the wheel of his taxpayer-funded vehicle after drinking alcohol and in one case after apparently smoking marijuana. Target 12 investigator Tim White first broke this story and has been on top of every development since. He joins us now from Coventry with more on tonight's new development. The Coventry Fire District Board voted to hire longtime attorney William Harsh to run the independent investigation. Harsh is the former head of the Department of Environmental Management and at one time served on the Rhode Island Ethics Commission. Suspended Fire Chief Paul Labadia's Fire Department SUV sits dormant in a bay at the Coventry Fire District. In a meeting that was so crowded they had to move it to a larger room, the four members of the board in attendance voted to hire attorney William Harsh as an independent investigator. We're taxpayers as well. We're frustrated. Board members telling the crowd they need to proceed carefully and legally or it could end up costing taxpayers more in the long run. For the record, we just, we're just following the law and doing things the proper way. The vote comes in the wake of a Target 12 undercover investigation into Chief Labadia. We often found him leaving work in a district vehicle paid for by taxpayers to go play golf in another town for hours on end, spotted him drinking during the day, then driving the SUV back to the fire department. We even have him taking the public safety vehicle to party up on Federal Hill, drinking and apparently smoking and sharing what appears to be marijuana with a group of others before once again getting behind the wheel. We also learned Labadia used a fire department vehicle several times to travel to his New Hampshire vacation home more than three hours away. In a wide-ranging interview, Chief Labadia denied wrongdoing. So you feel taxpayers should be confident about how much time you're putting in despite all the extracurricular activities that we have? Most definitely. I do my job. The district runs fine. I'm always available 24-7 when anybody needs me. We were um, quite shocked. Yeah. Uh, we didn't realize I kind of thought it was a problem and realize the gravity of, wow, there's a, there's a big problem here. Firefighters Union President David Gorman says the finances at the department are so dire, he's worried they're on track to be like neighboring Central Coventry District, which was placed into receivership by the state. I came off my chair the other day, same exact comparisons as to withholdings, uh, we're going down the same path. William Harsh, again tapped to run the independent investigation, ran twice unsuccessfully for attorney general in 2002 and 2006. Now, a board member tells me he expects the investigation to take about two weeks. With the Target 12 investigators, Tim White, Eyewitness News. The Target 12 investigators are always looking to uncover news. If you want to send a tip or report government waste, you can call our tip line 228-1763 or email us at target12 at wpri.com.